Sorry for guy. I'm gonna hurt on him. Let's see if I can let's just get this head down. Turn around! Another headshot. Headshot. Welcome back, Mech Warriors. This is Kung Grex's Prime coming at you with some Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries Heroes of the Inner Sphere DLC. The new campaign mission we're going to be tackling on these episodes are going to be hazing the week. And what are we looking at here, guys? This is a crazy pain scheme here that I was able to get from a hero mech catapult that I was able to acquire uh, as I was transitioning to this mission. And this thing is crazy. Not only is it a catapult, but it's a laser bolt catapult. Most catapults have these two big like boxes on the back end right there. And um, normally they have LRMs, which is long range missiles. This one does not. This one is by design a laser uh, bolt, as I like to call them. Some people call them, uh, uh, there's another name for them. Uh, oh, good Lord. I can't think of the name right now. But anyway, make a long story short, it has these weird black antennas, right? You guys see that in the back? And um, those big black antennas are actually not antennas at all. They're actually AMS. This thing is an AMS boat. It has two AMSs. Now, my favorite mech right now that I've been piloting the heck out of is this one right here, which is the Dragon. Uh, DSW, I believe it is. Or SSW. And um, that thing is pretty stout as well. But this this thing is just crazy looking. Anyway, it's a pretty fast catapult for for its... Uh, for its size and it um it packs quite a punch so we're gonna go ahead and go to the battle mech area so i can showcase what's exactly in this thing so we'll go click on that and as you guys can see it has two uh small lasers two medium lasers two large lasers now i should change those large lasers to like er but it's okay we're, we're gonna work it how it is and i have two ams on there as well as i said you guys could get a better view of this crazy paint scheme this thing looks sick you know i don't know if it's supposed to be like an iguana or or a snake whatever the hell it is dude it looks dope you know what i'm saying i i don't know this this paint scheme is ridiculous i was also able to get my hands on a really good uh, battle master as well this is another one of my uh like favorite like assault class mech between the battle master and the highlander which took a beating <clears throat> it's being repaired right now and of course uh the 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 SDW, I'm sorry, the Dragon is uh, like, this has been a mech that you guys have seen me use a lot in uh, the previous campaign. But in this mission, at least in the very first one, we're going to be using, showcasing this catapult. So that's the plan. So what we're going to do is go over to contracts and it's called Hazing the Week Part 1. It's a level 65 difficulty in this campaign mission. I believe it's a defense mission. So what I'm going to do is take a little bit of damage coverage, right? Just in case it doesn't hurt. And up my money a little bit to yeah let's see how much is it without it 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 doesn't really it's just adding to this i guess so that's fine and then what we're going to do is use the rest for shares because i want to be able to salvage some good stuff and lately in these uh missions that are above level 60 there's been a lot of good equipment dropping and i just haven't had the salvage shares to take it so we're going to stop that we're going to start uh worrying about more about salvage shares and just a little bit of coverage so we'll do that because of the heavy weather your visibility will and be compromised on this mission commander we don't have to worry about this thing and we're definitely not bringing this heavy this is a heavy lance we're not going to do all that what we're going to focus here is on bringing that catapult number one and seeing where we're at and wait where are you there you are so we're going to carry that um we're going to see if the we can bring one one assault class make i believe let's bring the black knight because this guy needs a little bit of lasering and we have 50 tons to play with so maybe reduce this mech down we're not going to bring something that heavy if we don't have to so let's go give him the arch why not <clears throat> he needs a little help with that so the arch is another uh that's the archer that i picked up on the last mission by the way so now i have 60 tons to play with which gives me options and um, I don't want to give him my mech. That's not going to happen. 
Sorry, buddy. You go fly a kite if you think you're going to fly my mech. Um, I guess we can shrink. We're going to have to play around with these mechs. I think I'm... So, here we go. That'll work. So, good lord. Every single mech except for this one is... <laughs> That's crazy. Every single mech here is a hero mech. That's a hero mech. That's a rifleman. The dual gauze rifles. This is just an SRM boat. I'm not really sure how well the computer is going to do with this setup, but we'll see. And then we can we can bring the Black Knight over here. I think that's what we're going to do. That will work. We're exactly through seven. There, that's perfect. So, basically, it's going to be me and the Catapult and the lightest mech here, which is... Hold on. Is it the lightest mech? No, I think the... Right, no, the right one is the lightest. So, second lightest mech is going to be the Catapult, the Archer, the Rifleman. And the Black Knight. So these three are hero mechs. That's pretty that's pretty crazy. But here we go, guys. I'm gonna ready up. Get this thing started. Been gawking at these mechs for too long, I think. Oof. This mech is just crazy like Commander. The will of Carly believes this location will be the next target of their rogue heretics. They want us to put these zealots down in order to shield their existence from the general public. Proceed to the Mort location and be sure to take out every one of these fanatics. Colin approaching mercenary lads. Stay your business. We have no need for you here. Wait, what are these battle mechs? Oh God, they've destroyed our perimeter watch. They're here to kill us. Hey, you don't need us though, my dude. All right, we got a big, 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 big push here. Let's go ahead and see if we can. Group target acknowledged. See if we can get this thing out. Target destroyed. All right, we got it. I know we got some battle mechs coming. We do have some pretty slow mechs here as well. I'm, I think I'm one of the fastest ones. Target acquired. Could be wrong. We're almost at max range. Here we go. Max spotted. I think we're on the other side of the mountain. Yeah, we did. Got another one. Target broken. Oh wow, this dude's almost dead. Target. Enemy mech down. Nice. Target acquired. All right, it's a little. Wilco. A little Irby mech. That's cute. That's cute. Here, swallow this. No life. He's even slower now. Bye bye. Enemy mech town. I feel like the Death Star with this mech, man. You guys see that? It's like all these different colors converging into a point. Okay, we may have had one of these dudes slip by, one of these tanks, maybe. I can't see though. Yeah, I see some laser fire over here. There's always one vehicle that always slips by. We, we got jump jets, though. We Target destroyed. Jump jet fuel low. Perfect. So let's let's take a look at this thing from the outside. Apparently, I took a hit, but I have no damage score. That's kind of weird. Tangos appear to be bringing in additional reinforcements. Brace yourselves. Target acquired. Far. Let's see what we can get. Let's get that thing. Let's see if we can get. We can get involved in this. Should be a range. Target destroyed. Target acquired. I got it. All right, we're good. All right, so we do have. Locus. We got some light mechs coming at us. Focus target received, Commander. All right. Let's get back internal, guys. I just can't pilot this thing. I don't know why. Just call me old school, but I don't seem to do well when I'm whenever I'm outside the map. What the hell is this thing? Really? You gonna just roll by like this? I don't think so, buddy. One more shot, and you're dead. Oh, is he still alive? Dead. Sorry, Commander, I can't 
Oh, I hate when that happens. Just as you click on the button for them to go, they you lose target. Focusing our fire on target. Why? I'll take out this tank right here. I want that one. Bye bye. Another tank, no problem. Hostiles inbound. Brace for contact, Commander. There was another. I think it was a Mac. Could be wrong. Let's see what. Oh my god. Land target received. I hear. There's like all kinds of crap in here. I'm, I'm doing damage to this place too. I almost hate coming in here. Where are these. These dudes, man. They're like hiding on the cliffside. What the hell? Got those guys out of the way. Oh, there is a max behind me. I was right. Hey, buddy, where you at? Going, going to town with that little machine gun, are you? Where you at? There you are. How you doing, little buddy? Good? Alright, you're gonna slow that thing down a little bit. Alright. You're gonna slow down your little mech. Cause these things do a lot of damage. Oh, what the? Are you Man, you better go on with yourself. Setting an intercept course on your position. Get out of this explosion. My dudes are in here making a mess. We're losing more and more of this base because my dudes are dancing all over these buildings. Piloting 101. I did see a... Got that guy out of the way. There should be a mech or something. My radar just sucks, dude. And there's a hunchback coming. Fantastic. Alright. Take care of this guy first. Leg is still up. Right, there you go. That's better. Slow up. I got something for you, man. Merry Christmas. Bye bye. Alright, let's move on to the next one. This mech is crazy, man. And, and I'm alpha striking and I'm not getting any kind of heat. Right now I'm not alpha striking, but I'm about to in a second here. Right here. My dude. How are you gonna just stop in front of my man? Stop moving. Let me knock that other man out. Oh you want some? Jump jet fuel low. Jump jet fuel empty. Where are you going? I didn't tell you you can go anywhere. Alright, let's move on to this. I believe there's a mech over here. For some reason my computer is not like handling this game as good as it used to. I'm gonna have to go check my settings after this mission. This is kinda odd. Oh no no he's spitting some heavy stuff. Gotta take that. Take that shoulder out, out of the Oh headshot. Woo! Oh lord, that was that was a hell of a shot. I was actually trying to aim for his shoulder. And I cop picked that dude, that was crazy. Trying to take his cannon out. I guess uh reconnaissance flights show increased enemy presence in the vicinity. Be on the lookout. Oh crap. Hostiles. That that's a long range catapult. We're on your target, Commander. Let's go knock that thing out. You guys saw the LRMs on? It says LRM 15s, four medium lasers. It's kind of a standard catapult. Now what why do I like this mech so much? Is because it resembles a clan mech that I really, really enjoy piloting. And it's uh that that clan mech is called, of course, the uh, the Mad Cat, aka the uh, the Timberwolf. For now, you 
what you, you know, if you're a clan tech guy or if you're an industry guy, depending on what the name is. Alright, buddy, you're, you're mine. You're gonna die right now. Right? Get out of here. Alright, Mr. Catapult, sorry, but you have to go. It could only be one. We can get a headshot. Don't know if that was a headshot, but. Definitely put a heart on that dude. And we're gonna chase down this dude. Unable, Commander, sorry. Of course, I restart. Play? All right, let's play, bro. Let me take your little chicken legs out real quick. Oh, man, somebody put a hurt on that, dude. It wasn't me. Let's get out of here. Let's, uh, let's, let's hit the afterburners and go in that direction because we got a missile boat trying to get to the base. It's really hard, like, unless you're playing solo. I mean, when you're playing solo, I mean, unless you go multiplayer, it's really, really hard to, like, command a defense area like this. Because you can, like, say, okay, I'm going to stay on this side of the field, you stay on the other, and, you know, and work it that way with two people, or even three people, or even if you have a full lens. Then you'll be good, but with these guys, they don't do nothing. Except just kind of hang out by... They don't, they don't, they don't even go like combat spread or nothing. It sucks. That's always been my complaint. I, you know what I want to do, guys? I think um, if the missions are like about this long. Oh crap! Enemy destroyed. All right. Focusing our fire on target. That dude has a freaking AC-20 burst fire. We're gonna, we're gonna go mess with little man right here. We can take those legs out. Almost there. We got him out of the way. Fire starter will be the next uh, mech, but I'm going to take out this tank first. Nice. So now we got it. I'm going to take out this fire starter. We're gonna solo it. Oh, they got they got the hunchback. Man, that hunchback's almost dead. Let me go back that way. Hold on a second. That dude just. I mean, if they tap his head, it's dead. If I can tap his head, guys, hopefully they let leave him alone. That double gauze rifle guy. Gonna hurt on him. Let's see if I can let me just get this head shot. Turn around. Another headshot. Headshot. Man. This mech is kind of nice, I, I must admit. New target, fire starter. And I don't even have like a great loadout. I could definitely put some ER lasers on this thing. Or even pulse lasers would be even great. Alright, come on, let's go. Can't see. It's gonna take a blind shot. Right. Sure you want to do that? So that's why. Knock that leg out. Like God, what was that? Who were those people? <laughs> I don't know who you are or what brought you to our settlement, but on behalf of my people, thank you for saving us. Nice work here, Commander. See you back aboard the ship. This was definitely a fun mission now my computer i don't know if you i don't know if it's gonna notice it in the in the recording or not but it feels like my something's i don't know there was a windows update every time there's a windows update it changes everything man it's so weird holy crap my damn catapult got freaking charred that's insane let's see what we got here guys all right so we did headshot him and headshot him that's how you guys see the missing head so both punch bags got headshot. Hit chalk. See if there's anything good before I decide to pick up something. I don't think so. I don't think anything's really worth our while down here. Nah. Okay, cool. So we're going to pick up the more expensive hunchback, the one that's in better shape. And uh, 
we'll have one point to play with so we'll just pick up one of these lasers right here we'll be fine a oh, lot wow, these guys have acting beacon probe and countermeasures as well pretty cool all right so that so we salvaged we only got 100k worth of damage and we had 400k as a uh, coverage we made about two and a half almost two and a half mil so that's that's actually really good guys that's not bad mad run after all and we completed this mission as well so we end up getting some srms and some more reputations of ipc bills upgrade junta thrust large tober compressor feed more re react reaction mass into the jets which increases compression vision and acceleration oh okay that is cool now does that mean that your mech um, with the jump jets. Oh, 15% jump jet acceleration. Huh. Wonder how that works out. We gotta try that. Now I have to try that. Alright, so as you guys can see, um, these are the talent points. I almost got most of these, like equipment, mech hunter, and treasure are the, are the easy ones. For some reason, for me, war dog seems to be the difficult one to do. So let's go ahead and repair all these mechs and the rifleman had to go out hardly any damage good lord and so that the black knight most of these guys took nothing for damage I, I think i took a little more that's pretty good this is a good mission this is the uh hunchback we salvaged and we're gonna hold on to it just in case we ever need cash this is kind of like my safety net here there's a couple mechs here like this thing i would definitely get rid of this thing that's another mech that i headshot it and salvaged so this mech right now is really good it reminds me of, of of having the black knight pretty much it can do the same thing with the black knight so this thing has jump jets and this ams system um which is which is something that that is passively going on you know it's not like um it looks like i have two antennas it's kind of funny um it, this is something that's passively happening. Nothing you have to do. So, this is always a plus. Is what I'm saying. So let's go to the galactic map and see. Uh, oh, we probably have to go back to uh, this place right here. And since we finished the contract, probably have to do the next transmission. Yeah. So hazing the week part two. Uh, man, this this lady is pretty mad. So this will be the next one. Let's see what we have to go before I. Cut this, cut this uh, episode down. Oh, it's right next door. So it'll take like 14 days. It'll be a demolition mission, which I might bring a different mech for this one. So we're going to be definitely bouncing around mech to mech. But anyway, guys, this will conclude this episode. And um, I think I'm going to just do smaller episodes for these. And hopefully you guys like that. And if you only if you like this kind of stuff, uh, don't forget to drop that like button. I know some people forget. And subscribe to the channel if you'd like to see more Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries. Here's the of the Inner Sphere DLC content. And eventually, once I beat all the campaign missions and I'm done with this game, I'm probably going to mod it and use like uh, Pirate Tech and all this other crazy stuff, all these other cool mods that this game has. But I wanted to beat it vanilla first. So stay tuned for that, guys, if you're interested. Drop a comment below. Let me know what you think. You guys have a great day and night. Light, love, and peace. Congrexes. Making out.